Hello, this is Warlord. Let's take a quick look at what happens to the camera when you bring your iClone 6 project into iClone 7. You'll notice when that you do that for the first time, you'll get this uh, box and you'll have these dark edges. The reason is there's a new system in iClone for cameras and it's so it'll work better with other software and things. And all you have to do to get it back like you want is come over here and make a few settings. If you don't see your, your camera over here, then click on your camera button. And then just come over here and set these both on horizontal. At least that's what I do. Now, to match the focal length, I usually hit 80 because that's pretty close for me. And this is pretty much where I leave mine when I'm bringing them back in to uh, iClone 7 from iClone 6. Now, it depends on uh, you know what your format was when you were in iClone 6, but you're going to see various sizes of those dark bars on the outside and all you have to do is come in and just set things to horizontal and you can come in here and play with your focal length to get it just like you want anyway it's just a lot more wide open system but this at least gets you back to where you were with iClone 6 <laughs>